Howdy all you cowboys, cowgirls, gunfighters, and gamblers. Welcome to another episode of Jedi TV. And before we get started today, I just want to take a moment and thank you all for the really excellent response to my 4440 black powder loading episode. I do plan on doing more of those in the future, even if YouTube insists on taking away my ad revenue for that content. Just make sure you're subscribed to Jedi TV so you don't miss the episodes when they are released. And with that said, let's just jump into today's episode, which is just a quick show and tell of my new knife sheath I got from my pard, Slick Alec. Now, Slick has made a lot of my leather gun rigs, including my Wild Bunch rig, my Plainsman gun belts and holsters, and my fantastic leather Nerf rig, which I should do a whole separate episode on that one. And Slick has worked with me on other crazy projects that I send to him, including my one-of-a-kind flame cuffs, and my Chewbacca bag for my Wild West Chewbacca cosplay, which probably deserves its own episode, so leave me a comment down below and let me know what you'd like to see more of. As for this new knife sheath, I wanted something for my limited edition Gerber Bowie knife. This blade was given to me years ago by my knife collecting pard, Richard. It's number 843 of 1500 Bowie knives that Oregon-based Gerber made in 1991. And that's one of those gifts that I really cherish. So I wanted a sheath for the knife that I could wear on my gun belt. But I found that sitting in some chairs with a knife on the back of my gun rig can be somewhat difficult. Sometimes it hangs up on the back of the chair and you end up standing with the chair still attached to you. And while that might sound convenient, it's really not. So years ago, I ordered this frog style sheath, one that can be easily removed without having to take the entire gun belt off. And it works pretty well, but it has kind of a generic build to it and the knife fits too loose in the sheath. So I went to my pard Slick Alec with just the concept of what I wanted, and I asked that he come up with a way to move the sheath from the frog on my belt to inside of my boot. Which my previous sheath did, but it was held onto the frog or into my boot just by this little metal nub. And while yes, it works, it isn't as secure a setup as the one like I have for my bare bones dagger. A knife, by the way, that was made for me by my pard, Barebone Smith. And you all have seen him on the show numerous times. The sheath for this Barebones dagger was made by my pard, Guano. And he used a cell phone clip covered in leather so that I could move the sheath from my belt to my boot, depending on how I wanted to wear it. I also asked Guano to come up with something to make the Damascus blade on the dagger visible, which he did by simply and neatly cutting out a section of the leather. So my request to Slick was that he do something similar, but with a more period correct flair. And Slick knows I like unique items and I trust him to come up with something that is both functional and unique. And he hit the mark with this Jedi special clip knife sheath and frog as he calls it. So let me know what you think of it down in the comment section below this video. I'll also be posting some close-up photos of it on my Instagram page, so go over and follow me there, at Jedi Gunfighter. Now, I just got this sheath, so I haven't had the opportunity to take it to a match yet, but I'll do that this weekend, and I'll let you all know how it works in those conditions, either in the comment section down below on this video, or on my Instagram page with a short video clip. I already know that I'll be working with Slick on the fit, because right now the knife doesn't appear to be seating all the way. And this fit is understandable as Slick was only going off for my measurements since he didn't have the knife to work with. And he also said in the included note, he has already come up with a plan to correcting that if it was an issue. Now, some of the details that I like are the extended protection that these tabs offer for the handle of the knife. And I like the use of the antique spoon to hold the sheath in place whether it's in the frog or in my boot. So thanks Slick for working on another fun and unique piece for me. I hope you all enjoyed this quick show and tell episode of Jedi TV. If you did, please be sure to hit that like button for me. I'm Jed, this is Jedi TV, and I'll see you in some other place in some other time. A special thank you to Billy Dixon from Germany and Jax T 
For their support of this channel at www.buymeacoffee.com slash Jedi TV. I wanted something for my limited edition Boot Gerber, David Bowie, Jim Bowie, Jim Bowie, Bowie knife, Bowie knife for that knife that, so I went with, so I went with, which my previous, now I haven't had the opportunity to take, I hope you all enjoyed this quick show. I'm just going to shoot that ending again.